My name is Levi Slendemeyer, and I'm the program director at the Health One Family Medicine Residency. Thank you for taking a little bit of time to get to know us better by watching this short video. My goal here is to give you a short glimpse of who we are and what we're doing. We are all about people, from our patients to our residents and faculty and our clinic staff. In hospital rotations are mainly at Skyridge Medical Center down in Lone Tree, and up here at the Medical Center of Aurora in the heart of Aurora with a diverse and underserved population. Our curriculum also includes many outpatient community-based physician partners who pour into the education of our residents. We have five specific tracks, including our maternity care track, which will either prepare the graduate to do low-risk obstetrics and vaginal deliveries, or prepare them to go on to an OB fellowship. We have osteopathic recognition, and our osteopathic recognition track really allows our resident to use what they learned as a medical student and further using OPP and OMM in the middle of a clinic visit. The hospitalist track adds extra inpatient medicine, sprinkle in some ICU, and then adds some specialty visits with the medicine specialists to prepare that resident when they graduate to do a career in hospital medicine. And finally, Dr. Vidlock will talk about our wilderness medicine track and our sports medicine track. Hi, my name is Kathy Vidlock and I'm one of the faculty at the Health One Family Medicine Residency. I've been faculty here since the program started and I am in charge of the sports and wilderness medicine tracks. The sports medicine track is designed for residents who want to go on and do a sports medicine fellowship, which is extremely competitive to get into. So we start you off at day one. We have sports medicine rotations, as well as opportunities to work with a local high school team as their team physician starting in your first year. We attend various games. You have opportunities in clinics to learn procedures and learn musculoskeletal ultrasound, as well as opportunities to work on QI projects and research, as well as case presentations at local and national conferences. I'm also in charge of the wilderness medicine rotation, which is a little bit more relaxed track and allows you opportunities to do QI studies and research in wilderness medicine areas, as well as a chance to be active in the outdoors. We do a lot of teaching in wilderness medicine through didactics. I think it's an incredible place to uh, work, but it's also an incredible place to train. The most important and most impressive part of this program is the clinic. It has everything you need from uh, uh, young to old, OB, um, people with multiple problems. You also learn the business of it because it's a real functioning uh, family medicine clinic. We enjoy having the residents here. We appreciate their help. They teach us a lot. They keep us from uh, getting behind. Uh, they help us to stay up to date. I came to this residency because of the people and the staff. I felt like I was included from the beginning. I felt like this staff has the worth, work ethic that I um, also connect with, as well as the um, ability to have fun and make everyone feel included. I came to this residency because I enjoyed the people that interviewed me, and I also enjoyed that there is a div diversity in the population in our hospital base. It's different than our clinic base, and that requires you to use a different skill set. I chose to rank Health One Family Medicine Residency because I could tell from the beginning when I first came for my interview that there was a lot of intention behind this program. The residents themselves were excited about new opportunities. Uh, one big thing about the Health One Family Medicine program that I think is key is the clinic. So the clinic is kind of the crown jewel of the residency program. and uh, as the clinic teaches the residents how to be outpatient family medicine um, uh, physicians. What I like about this residency is that people, um, the people that make up the program, um, I think it takes a village to get through a residency and there's a lot of support here. Um, 
What we're learning in residency requires really dedicated and supportive both residents and faculty. Um, I got the sense when I interviewed back in December 2019 um, that that was the case, and that's exactly what I've experienced here. Everybody is incredibly close-knit, willing to listen from the administration to our program director to the residents themselves. Really, what truly makes this residency special is the friendships that we've developed, um, is the support that we give, whether or not you know we're just going out for a casual bite after after clinic or we're helping people through difficult times um, or actually going out and having adventures on the weekends. I came to this residency because the people. I feel like it's a huge community here. I feel extremely supported not only with my fellow residents and staff but also with the faculty and administration. I feel like anytime I have a question or a concern, it's addressed immediately. And I feel like every time I come to work, it's like coming home to family. I am one of the few that has actually been here since day one, um, when the residents first started here. And that is because my um, uh, private practice of 20 years was actually transformed into the continuity clinic for the residents. It has been a pleasure to watch the program grow and expand. Uh, over the past you know four years and to be a big part of that. We also have extremely strong connections with Rocky Vista University here in town which is our osteopathic college um, and as we um, originated as an osteopathic program it is extremely important to us that we maintain our osteopathic recognition and so therefore um, we will uh, continue to work closely with RVU Within the clinic, uh, we have three exam rooms that are set up for OMM treatments. We have the capability of doing um, uh, hot packs and soft tissue work as well. They're great to work with. Everybody's eager to learn. Everybody's eager to um, assist one another. Um, it's very almost family oriented. Um, and I absolutely love being able to help with the residency program and be able to help shape the future of medicine. So what do I do with the residents? Um, of course, all things mental health, wellness, professionalism, self-care, interpersonal skills, and communication skills. Um, additionally, I do group support with the residents, individual support, um, and in clinic, I do precepting and observations of your clinical work. Our residents enjoy spending time together and enjoy all that Colorado has to offer, but don't take my word for it. In my spare time, I enjoy hiking, biking, there's always someone in this residency who's willing to drop what they're doing for the evening if you need time to just decompress. I climb a lot and it's really nice because um, you, have, you have little crags and areas that are close to you um, that you can access right after work. I tell my co-resident that I climb with all the time, how lucky are we that we get to do this after work like every day during the summer basically if you want to. And then my time off, um... I enjoy really exploring the outdoors, whatever I can do to get outside, get in the mountains. Um, I enjoy rock climbing, um, Clear Creek Canyon's real close, I've gone there a lot. There's a ton of other climbing opportunities in the area, um, hiking, mountain biking, you know, just getting out, enjoying the sunshine, which Colorado has ample amounts of. During my time off, my wife and I enjoy biking around Cherry Creek State Park, which is right near our house. Um, there's a beautiful lake and we just really enjoy the outdoors that are surrounding us. On my time off, I really enjoy doing things outdoors. You know, I love camping, I love fishing, I love biking, climbing, uh, river rafting. I used to be a guide for river rafting. There's a sense of peace and calmness that I never really felt um, growing up on the East Coast. Um, and just having nature close by is so important to resident wellness and resilience and it is so nice to keep that balance in life here. During my time off, I enjoy everything that Colorado has to offer, whether it's snowboarding in the winter, uh, during the summer, uh, my wife and son and I uh, go hiking through the mountains and we also enjoy going to the Colorado Rapids games. We have season tickets. They're awesome. I'm Juliana Stasek and I'm the program coordinator here. I've been with the program since day one and I can't wait to meet you all during this interview season and work to get a new class of interns for next year. You can check us out on our Instagram page at Health1FMR or our Facebook page at Health1 Family Medicine Residency. Thank you.